All right, trying to remove this plate. Had to remove the four bolts, and then it was really tight still. I realized I had to remove this small bolt in the center here. Okay, I'm re installing remote hydraulics on my 1963 Ford 4000. It is, at least I think that's what it is. It's hard to read the numbers. It says 800 up here. But Ford 4000 on the side. Anyway, first step. Or first thing I did is I drained the hydraulic fluid from underneath and then I removed this plate the four bolts here and then also the center one and then seems pretty easy I guess you just install this bad boy We'll see. All right, got the hoses on. Pretty straightforward. Use a little tape there. Uh, put the O-rings in. This one is kind of it's a circle O-ring. You just gotta deform it a little bit. But well, let's see if it fits. Okay, looks like it fits. Got our four bolts here. Two short ones, two long ones. Let's figure out where they go. And I guess the next step will be to route the hoses back there and use this bracket somewhere back there. All right, ran into one small problem. For some reason the instructions say to put the hoses on before you bolt it to the tractor. But then you can't get this last bolt in here. So not a big deal. Just pull the hoses off and install it. <laughs> 